today. And if you do have any questions in relation to the bidding process or indeed you have uh, any uh, assistance required with the bidding today, I'm sure they'll be able to assist oh, oh. you here today, guys. It is a public auction here in the state of Victoria, which means that the auction shall be conducted in accordance with the rules and any additional conditions that were made available for your inspection before the start of today's auction. Those auction rules prohibit the auctioneer from accepting bids or offers after the property has been knocked down to the successful bidder and buyers. I will point out that uh, being an online auction, you have time to get your last bid in here this afternoon. But if you have finished bidding, I will get you to simply type out into the chat, just as a courtesy to the other bidders, so that we know that you've finished bidding and we know that we can sell away to our highest bidder here this afternoon. Now, in order to have reserve price, as the auctioneer, I'll indicate bidders on request. And the law permits vendor bids. The words I use to indicate I'm making a bid on behalf of the vendor are uh, vendor bid, and by law, only I, as the auctioneer, can make a vendor bid. Well, ladies and gentlemen, may I are your bidding terms? There are two ways in which you can bid here at the auction today. Uh, one is by typing your offer or your bid into the chat box. The second is by unmuting your microphone, turning on your camera. And, uh, and yelling out your bid as you would on a uh, an on-street auction buyers. It is important to point out that the uh, raise hand function uh, does not work and it does not constitute a bid here today. So if you are hitting that button at any stage, um, that, uh, that button won't have any effect on the auction at all. You need to make sure that you yell out your bid or type it into the chat. And, uh, and Danny, who is working behind the scenes today, will enter those bids in and you'll see the bids come up on the screen overlaid on top of the images of this fantastic home and uh, they'll initially start in white we get to a point where we're on the market you'll hear me say those words the numbers will turn to green and from there we sell away to the highest bidder here today ladies and gentlemen it is an outstanding opportunity if you are the lucky and successful bidder here today a positive link 10 percent of the price that you've bidden by for is what you're required to bring forward. We can accept $20,000 of that by way of EFT and the balance on Monday, either by bank check or by EFT. The balance of payment money, vacant possession settlement offered, a very flexible period. The owners are giving you the freedom of choice between 60 days and 120 days from today's date. So that gives you the option of settling either in 2021 or into that early part of 2022. With, uh, with a settlement of 120 days. And buyers, as I said in the beginning, I can't accept a late bid or offer. So bear that in mind as we get to that point, as we move through the auction, as you're putting those last bids in, make sure you get your bid in nice and early. Any stage through the auction, if you do get cut off from the Google Meet, please make contact with Christine. Danny will put Christine's phone number into the chat for you so that you've got her number at hand. We want to make sure that everyone is included in the auction from the start to the end. Because buyers, I don't know how long it will be before we have a home, especially at 17 Hertford Crescent in Willis Hill, hit the market. For those that have come through the home, it's undeniable the quality of the build. The, um, the presentation that the owners have provided is nothing short of first class, ladies and gentlemen. The location close to Willis Hill Primary, to Caulfield Grammar, to all of the shopping facilities and amenities that, um, that make Willis Hill an exciting place to be. Of course, Gels Park with gatherings of five plus now allowed at, uh, at, the, um, at the parks and for picnics. Certainly by the time you settle, I'm hoping that things have opened up a bit more and you can, uh, you can use those facilities even more than you can today, buyers. But it's more than just a location. It's an outstanding home, some 906 square metres of land, triple garage, as you can see there, a striking facade as you drive up and, and as your friends and family arrive at your new home, you can, uh, you can show them through, of course. Generous proportions, and I think if you're comparing apples with apples in the market, there is certainly no comparison to the vast space, the vast proportions that are on offer here from that formal lounge and dining room space, the kitchen meals area, and then that rumpus room, which almost mirrors in size the triple garage, ladies and gentlemen. That gives you some ideas about the proportions here. Five generous bedrooms upstairs, study just inside the door, which, uh, which doubles nicely as a home office. Of course, features that you would expect in a home of this quality, ducted heating and cooling, your, uh, your heated in-ground swimming pool, the sauna, all of the trimmings are there, ladies and gentlemen, and it is a move straight in home. Move straight in and enjoy and be the envy of all
all of your family and friends here as you uh, as you move in and settle into life in Hertford Crescent. Ladies and gentlemen, don't hesitate today. You need to bid to buy. Here is your opportunity. Oh, yeah. Rummy bid for offer to get us underway by 17. Hertford Crescent here in Willis Hill. Where are your... 1,710,000. 1,710,000. Welcome there, Jim. At one million seven hundred and ten thousand dollars, and let's move together, bidders and buyers from there. What about one million seven fifty to keep it moving? At one million seven hundred and ten, the call rounded up and away we go, buyers. At one million seven fifty, anywhere at all. At one million seven fifty, or better bid, of course, higher offer if you like. At one million seven ten, the call. What about fifty now? At one million seven ten, type your bid into the chat or. Jim has done yelling out at the auction now. At one million seven tens, the call we all done surely not. At one million seven hundred and ten thousand dollars, bidders and buyers, here is your opportunity. At one million seven ten, can we call it fifty anywhere? At one million seven ten, can we call it seven fifty on top? One million seven hundred and ten thousand dollars. I said the raise hand function does not work. You need to type your bid in or dollars. Seven twenty. I'm going to be one eight. Ten at this stage. Fifty eight. C four. Welcome there at seven five five. Head one million seven fifty. Head one million eight. 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 Head